Well, the history of this river, it, it dates back 60 years or better before uh, Plymouth Rock, which is very interesting to me. I mean, you can go into some of the New England towns and see the history there, but when you come on the river and find out the history of the, the Spanish and also uh, the English, like uh, William Bartram and Spalding and all those people that came here in the 1760s, and uh, there was a lot going on in this part of Florida. On the large boat, I take 20, 20 passengers. Uh, that goes out, it departs at 10, 1, and then we have an afternoon tour that's seasonal, and we announce that on our website. Then we have the two smaller boats that are more for the, uh, for the serious eco-ventures where we can get back into the smaller estuaries. So now we're traveling on the river. Over here is Volusia County, and that's Lake George State Forest. And this side over here is Lake County, and that's Ocala National Forest. Oh, here, we got a little guy over here. Now I'm gonna tell you the secret of finding alligators. You look for something that looks like a truck tire. Yeah, we're gonna see a lot of, lot of alligators. For every alligator we see, there'll be 30 of them that see us that we don't see them. You see them ridges on their back. Underneath those ridges, they've got this uh, osteoderm or alligator scoot. It's a bone and they're free floating. They're, they're not uh, attached to the skeleton or anything and blood is coursing through them. The black skin's up against them, heating the bone up. It's a solar panel. Yeah. Solar panel and armor plating. You can see the little baby's heads up there. And she's feeding them right now. Basically, it's the enjoyment that I get out of it is showing people Florida that they miss. A lot of times they're driving the different highways and staying too long at the beaches and uh, some of them attractions in Orlando. <laughs> and uh, I like to pull them away from there once in a while and bring them out and show them what real Florida is supposed to look like. And uh, a lot of people are amazed.